You're now watching The Wash daily. Today news, area activist Tom Rand made high times. They were asking him questions about his history with Patriots Helping Events, which is the organization he started where the Patriots help vets. Now Tom's a Marine. He's been for 25 years helping veterans get help they need and get cannabis. He's been helping people learn to grow and learn to cultivate and clone and cure all the cannabis, all the stuff you need to know to grow your own cannabis and, and give yourself the medicine that you probably need. Now, a lot of vets are doing well when they use cannabis. Unfortunately, the federal government doesn't allow them to. And for PTSD, is actually very deadly. I think a veteran kills themselves like once every minute in our country. Uh, whereas cannabis is actually, instead of opioids or opiates, are has been shown to really help folks deal with a lot of that stuff. Uh, obviously, it doesn't make it easy, but it helps when they can at least get help. So good job, Tom Rand, for making a big difference for so many people. Also in news, AI is becoming very prominent in the cannabis industry. It's been a long time that people were using automated systems for their grow ops. Now there's robots that'll scour your cannabis grow to find out the males or the females or see which ones are ready for harvest or which ones aren't or which terpenes or cannabinoids are available. It's pretty intense. Also, there's all kind of AI stuff for managing the cannabis business, and people are just using ChatGPT for just about everything, so good luck with jobs in the cannabis industry. Looks like robots are gonna be running this show. Also in news, in New York, two doctors are making the claim that a uh, new problem people are experiencing, myocarditis and strokes and blood clots, is because of cannabis. They looked at 3 million patients, of those 600,000 said they were cannabis users, and of those, 2,400 had PAD, which is this peripheral artery problem where you get blood clots in your legs and you can't move your legs and you have a heart attack. But they're thinking it's probably the weed. Makes sense. Thanks for watching The Walk Daily.